Hey everybody, Dale here. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. And when you're all done, if you would click on subscribe, maybe give me a like, I would appreciate it. So let's get to it. I'm going to show you three methods for disabling driver updates in Windows Update or through Windows Update. Now, if you like to tinker like me, you sometimes don't want Microsoft to download driver updates. It might mess up something that you did custom. Maybe you got a special driver for your video card, a beta driver, or a special driver for your touchpad. In any case, I'll show you three methods to disable that. The first one is pretty simple, and it works great in Windows Home. Uh, first thing we're going to do is go to our control panel, the legacy control panel. If your search box is turned on or enabled, you can just type in control. It should pop right up here, or you can right-click on your start button here click on run and just type in control panel two words and hit OK so we're gonna go to our control panel and we're gonna go to system right here then we're gonna go to advanced system settings on the left over here then up here we're gonna click on the hardware tab then right here where it says device installation settings click on that and we're gonna choose no Yes, recommended is the default setting. Save your changes, hit OK, and that's it. And the second method I'm going to show you, <clears throat> excuse me, is done through the Group Policy Editor, which only works on Windows 10 Pro or Enterprise, or in Home Edition if you got it installed successfully. But Windows Home doesn't come with the GP Edit. So to get to that, we're going to right click on our Start button, we're going to go to Run. We're going to type in GP, it's right here, gpedit.msc, hit OK. And once this opens, I'll make it a little bigger here. So we're going to go over to Computer Configuration, double click Administrative Templates, Windows Components, and go all the way down to Windows Update, click it once. And then we're going to find the one that says right here. Sorry, staring me in the face. Right here, do not include drivers with Windows Updates. Double click it. You're going to enable it. Hit Apply and then OK and exit the GP edit. And the last and final way is through the we're going to do an edit in the Windows registry but you I gotta give you a disclaimer here just be really careful when you're in the registry change and stuff and always restart when you make any changes to your registry. So we're going to open up reg edit again you can go into your search box and type in reg edit and it's right here or same thing over here in the run box just type in reg edit and hit OK. Hit yes on user account control, of course. So you got administrative privileges. So let me close this all out here. So we're going to go to H key local machine. Then we're going to go down here to software. We're going to go to policies, double click it. And then we're going to go to, oops, oh, my bad, we're going to go to Windows Update, well, I already have it in here, so let me delete that, so what we're going to do is we're going to right click over here, we're going to create a new value name, just right click, go to new, right here, choose this option, D word, 32 bit value, then in this box here, we're going to name the value. Let's clear that out of there. We're going to type it in exactly as I got it here. Exclude WU drivers in quality update, just like I got it there. Then hit enter. And then just double click it. And over here, you're going to change the value data to the number one. And hit OK and exit the registry editor. 
then do a restart after that. And I've tried all three of these methods, and they all seem to work. And I haven't had any stability issues or anything like that. But again, be very careful when you're in the regist registry editing stuff. Um, so that's it. I hope you found this helpful. And again, don't forget to subscribe. I would appreciate it very much. Thanks for watching, and have a great night.